That's a very difficult question. The, it is very clear that the outlook for patients with lupus has changed dramatically. 50 or 60 years ago, if you had kidney disease in, in lupus, essentially you died. And this was the era before um, kidney treatments like dialysis and transplantation were available. We now have uh, better ways of diagnosing uh, lupus early and we have very effective treatments. So the prognosis, the outlook for patients with lupus has dramatically improved. We're not there yet in terms of a cure, but this is why we're all still uh, looking after lupus patients and this is why we're all doing research into lupus and that's the ultimate holy grail is to find a cure for lupus. We are making great progress in understanding the biology of lupus and by understanding the biology of lupus and understanding which cells are involved uh, we can target treatments according to those molecules. Um, certain aspects of lupus are very treatable and indeed can be curable for example certain forms of skin disease we are uh, very good at treating those and the skin disease can go away and stay away. Other aspects of lupus, for example kidney disease, are much less easy to treat and we have not yet achieved a cure for kidney disease. Be aware that uh, women with lupus, and women are the most likely to develop lupus, as women pass the menopause it is quite possible for lupus to go into complete remission and it is possible to come off treatment, although that's not technically a cure because uh, the lupus can still come back, um, I think there is a lot of optimism um, for, for patients generally with lupus.